Hello, brothers and sisters. I am Jen Kitain, and this is Pathways of Hope. I recently came upon a story about Dwayne The Rock Johnson. Apparently, when he was a teenager, he was lost and homeless. But a kind man named Bruno Lauer took him in and gave him shelter. Not only that, took care of him to the point where Bruno even bought Rock his first car. Dwayne The Rock Johnson said, that experience of kindness changed the trajectory of my life for the better. And it took him a while to figure out how to repay Bruno. But finally, he was able to do so by buying him a car, a more expensive one, of course, and gifting it to his um, old friend. The video clip was so touching. Bruno actually said to The Rock, you know, I'm so grateful for you and I love you, not just because of this scar, but because of who you are. You are my brother. You're my brother too, Dwayne said. And as Bruno rode the car and started it, he uttered this prayer. He said, Lord Jesus, I don't know what I did to deserve such a brother and friend in Dwayne. And at the same time, he was making the sign of the cross. In today's gospel, brothers and sisters, Jesus says that whoever does the will of the Father is his mother, brothers, and sisters. In this story that I just told, it's so obvious that Bruno, who loves God, became a true brother to Duane. Sometimes those kinds of brotherhoods are even thicker and stronger than blood brotherhood. That is the way it is with our relationship with God. When we do what God wants, our family expands. We're never lonely. We're never in want for good people in our lives. We experience kindness, always praying for us. Somebody's always looking out for us just like Jesus does. In my life, I've experienced this for the last 30 or so years because of the community that I belong to. Being part of a community where people constantly pray for you and care for you and even correct you if you need it in a loving way, of course. It's all such a blessing because you know that you can go to heaven you can be a good person in this life if somebody else, a great cloud of witnesses, are cheering you on and helping you. Brothers and sisters, this is what Jesus was talking about. And I pray that if you are looking for this, this kind of family, come to Jesus and he will add to you more brothers, more sisters, a bigger family, not just on earth but also for eternity. God bless you, brothers and sisters.